it's so early in the morning there's like nobody in here so i get to talk as loud as i want to um and as you can see there's not really that big of a selection of plants so let's walk through and see what we find hopefully there's some hidden gems in here so here we have some four size snake plants i think they're 1.7 gallon 8.43 liters so a big plant <laughs> for 29.84 here we have Venus fly traps for 547. The only one that seems like it's really thriving is the one that lost its top. Here's a Birkin. I'm gonna try these right now. Ooh, 2096 here for the um, trending tropicals. Kimberly Queen Fern, which they say is great for helping you to stay centered. Have you noticed that these um Costa Farms now has plants with benefits. The Kimberly Queen Fern is to help you stay centered. I think when I saw the ficus last week, it said something about to help you stay focused. That's $11, really good price and cute little pot. Here we have a moonshine, whoops, sorry. A moonshine Sansevieria. It does have, look like it has like some rot on it because these desperately need sun. Or they'll revert back to this green color. I think like this one has the pretty silver hue. I really like these planters, but this is six inches for $16.96. And they have a few of those, so yeah, they definitely have a few of those. So they have lots of $16.96 price points, plants with benefits, ZZ plant. It says that this one will help lower your stress levels. And this is a Calathea medallion. Plants with benefits. So that's the plants with benefits collection. And Janet Craig Compactica, I think she's called. Calathea. So this one was for the Calathea. Is that a Clathea? I thought that was like a polka dot plant. I think this one might be the Clathea. Okay. I think the Clathea, I want my phone to focus. The Clathea's uh, helped improve concentration, creativity, and productivity. All of the trending tropicals are $20. Well, oh, she's been there for a while. It seems, yeah, it seems like these plants have been sitting here for a good little minute. For you. Is it like a some type of Pelea? Yeah, Peperomia raindrop. Here we have some blooming plants and then like succulent arrangements. This one just looks like a faux plant. <laughs> the way it looks so green and juicy. We have Anthuriums here. We have some ZZ plants that are twenty dollars and ninety six cents. The Raven ZZs. So this is something new. I've never seen these like um, in a spot all together. <laughs> so many, but they have a little Swiss Monstera Adenosai. That's twenty ninety six. Ooh, I know these came from Miami. That's what I'm trying to get to. I'm trying to get to Florida so I can see some beautiful plants. Hmm. Here's one of those teardrop peperomias. It looks in like better condition, more recognizable. Some more Birkins. They're pretty coloring. Some large Dracenas. I have this plant at home. If I showed it to you, you'd be like, what in the world? had it for some years now it's still alive for a year probably it's still alive but it does not look good and then more of the Sansevieria's 36 inch so this is how tall they are for 29 and then we do have some exotic angel plants yeah this one looks really good it has lots of new growth coming out got Stephanie <laughs> Oh, 
China doll. Those are plants I have never seen. It's just pretty. My name is Houseplant Beautiful Home Decor. This one's nice and fuzzy. I think this is like a variegated China doll. Pink Angel. Petonia. Oh, wow. Petonia Argonilla from Peru. Low light. So pretty. So pretty. So, is this some type of ivy? I may have found my plant for today. It's like an ivy tree. Pia tree ivy. I've never seen this, but I'm in love. So I'll put that one to the side. But I have another one too. Always look and see which one's the best one, of course. The other one has has no growth on it. Hmm. Some goni, the fumbakia, the china dog thing. See, they kind of look similar, you know? More Fetonia plant, red vein Fetonia. Lately, I've just been so obsessed with the Fetonias. Where's the other one? Like, look at them next to each other. They barely even look related to each other. Black rabbit's foot. Ooh, look at it. The majestic or the majesty palms for twenty dollars. More majesty palms and the dracenas over there. I see um Moonshine Sansevieria just sitting out here, so I wanna see if she looks a little bit better. Yeah, she has like way more silverness to her. Yeah. Well, there's more plants outside. I'm happy I came out here. This looks like their watering station. So they have more of those Swiss plants. There's a Fatona, the red vein up there. I don't know what's happening to her. <laughs> or maybe this is like clearance section, but there's no clearance prices, so I'm not sure. Hmm. Yeah, maybe they just finished watering all of these. They're very wet. Yo, yo, yo.